Sportsman's Adventures is presented by Yamaha. Wow, look how many permits Go. there are. Go. Look. Oh my gosh. Look at the permits going by, Bree. There's an acre never of permits. Seen so look many. at this. It's crazy. Only a mama could love that mouth. Bringing home the snapper. That's what Florida wow. is famous for. Okay, guys, you're clear. That was a good show, Rick. Good High job, Bree. Hey, Bree, you know what? I checked what? the weather and it's gonna be slick calm tomorrow and I heard that the permit are on all the rick wrecks and reefs out in the Gulf. So I'm what do you think? You wanna go? To go fishing? I'm asking you to go permit fishing. What? Let me think about it. Yeah. Alright. What time? Five o'clock. Okay, we're all going right. fishing. I got the chicken. Okay. So Bree, you know last night when I said you wanna go fishing. Do you think we would end up in Big Pine Key first thing in the morning? Well, there's, you joke a lot, Rick, but if there's one thing you don't joke about, it's fishing. So I'm not surprised we're here, but I'm really happy we're here. We've got the perfect weather. It's in the month of May. And when you have this kind of weather, you got to take advantage of what this boat offers. So we're going to run out into the Gulf, 50 to 60 miles out of the Gulf, and see if we can't find some permits. They get on the structure as a spawning thing this time of year, and they haven't moved into the flats yet. All right, well, I hope you catch one today, Me babe. too. I'm so excited. Me too. Let's make the run. Breathe. Yeah. Stay connected there, girl. I'm saying. Remember, big permit. It's not going to be a two-second deal. All right, so remember, if he goes to the left, Go to the you left. Go to the left. Doing all good, right. girl. All right. Calm down. That's all you gotta do. Just stay connected to him. We're in a long-term relationship. This permit and I. So, Bree, what we're fishing here is you're fishing. Suffix. A 5-0 BMC 7385 circle hook. No weight. We have 20 pound suffix fluorocarbon leader. And the reason why I got, went down to 20 is because we're putting about eight or 10 feet on there. And the reason I went down to 20 is because the water here in the Gulf so is pretty clear. Clear, yeah. And the calmer it gets, the harder it's going to be to fool these kids. What they do, and you see it a lot on a calm day, <laughs> is they've got these mats of grass, like that one right there that you see. And what'll happen is that'll house a crab. And they'll come up using that round head of theirs, and they hit the grass to head. dislodge noggin. that noggin. You know, they hit the, hit the grass and hopefully knock a crab or a shrimp out of the grass. Oh, I see, I see color. You see him? I see him. Oh, that's a big permito. Think about this now. You and I have been working together. You're the co-host of the Chevy, Chevy Florida, Florida Insider Fishing Report and the Texas Insider Fishing Report. Yeah. This is our fourth year together. Did you ever think that when you came and applied for the job that you could make a career out of fishing? I had no female idea. Female fishing? I had no idea. I think it's so awesome that, you know, you are actually the the leader of the pack in the female arena, you know? Well. I like it. I like it too. Doing a good job. Good job. That's it. That's it. All right, shorten the circles. You know, these permit are like a tuna. They do this pinwheel around the boat. Each right. time, if you can shorten the circle, see there, there it is. Keep pulling right. That's it. Oh, look at the size of this permit. You scared him. Right? You might want to get him over here and let me grab him before somebody else does. Okay, okay, okay. There you go, Woo! Bree. Man, that's a good one there. I'll help you out there. Oh, my gosh. 
Reach in there and grab him. That's a nice one. Wow. So gorgeous. Look at the perfect circle oh, there's the nostrils right in the corner. Out. Yeah, so look at this. Here's the what I was talking about. Those big nostrils, Bree. Yes. He's got two of them. And I believe that part of his eating something, oh, yeah. it's got to have some smell. You know? Look at how, feel his lips. He's got rubberized lips because the crabs, you know, they'll pinch their lips. I don't care. And if you ever catch one yeah. that's a really big old fish, mm -hmm. a lot of times they have like calluses on their lips from oh. all the years of eating crabs. All right, here we go, Bree. All right. We're let this guy go. Okay. Look. Bye bye. Look at those black peck fins. They're so, so cool. Pretty. All right, I here like we go, Bree. I'm gonna let him go. Okay, bye. There you go, Mr. Permit. Sportsman's Adventures is brought to you by Yamaha. Reliability starts here. Rapala. Catch the latest at rapala.com. Costa Sunglasses. See what's out there. Okuma, inspired fishing. And Startron, cures and prevents fuel problems. Master your most challenging offshore experience with confidence and ease with Yamaha Helmmaster. Precise, intuitive control on the open sea. Unrivaled ease for maneuvering and docking in port. And now Setpoint adds three new dimensions to boat control. Maintain boat position with fish point, or a position and heading with stay point, or a heading while you drift with drift point. Yamaha Helmmaster, now with Setpoint. Complete digital control for today's larger offshore boats. As close as you're gonna get to a sure thing for catching billfish is Guatemala. They're here, man. This has been a 20 year run, buddy. These things haven't left, there's no cycle. When it comes to sail fishing, this is the real deal. The amount of sailfish here is ridiculous. Building Conservation Trust, or BCT, is Coastal Conservation Association's national habitat program. BCT is striving to be the largest program of its kind in the United States by restoring degraded habitats, creating new habitats, advancing the science of coastal habitat and marine fisheries conservation, fostering habitat stewardship, and educating coastal communities of the value of conservation. Visit www.buildingconservation.org to learn more on how you can make a difference. Thanks for watching Sportsman's Adventures. You can catch all the happenings, contests, and appearances by visiting us on sportsmansadventures.com. There you can find us on Facebook, follow us on Instagram and Twitter, but best of all, you never have to miss a show because you can find full episodes of Sportsman's Adventures along with tips and techniques, bonus clips, and even some bloopers. Also, if there's a product that we use during the show, that you would like more information on, you can find links to our sponsors at the bottom of the home page. Bree, all right, flip it over there in front of that big one. Hurry, just stray it on the water right there. Boom, see? You didn't wait for the big one, Bree. All right, real, Bree. <laughs> yeah! Oh, but he liked this trolling motor, though. I'm gonna get another one, we'll catch the other one. Look at all this carnage in the- Oh, no! Look at all the carnage. Do you want to talk about a rookie move, Rick? No. Come on, Bree. He went circles around the freaking trolling motor. All right, hold on. Back off on the, open the bail. I did. I'll lift the trolling motor up. Did you get it undone? Huh? Yeah. You done? Okay, good. Okay. 
That's just the why you real. We're back in action. Woo. You know why that worked, Bree? Because the line wasn't tight. Right. There we go. We got the double header. Double Yay! Woo. The cool part is, no matter where you are in the Florida Keys, Bree, there's Gulf Rex that you can access. Brie, you ever had Kobia sushi? Yes, I have. It's very good. You're gonna have Kobia sushi in your mouth tonight. Okay? Sushi in my mouth, my yeah, favorite. No, you like it. What? I'm coming back. You coming to me? Cause I got. I'm coming to you. That's a big one. Ready? Ready. Wow. Oh. Woo! That's a Woo. lot of Kobia for a red business. That's a good thing you did that, cause that just came out of his mouth. All right, Brie, watch that. Watch that. What do you want me to do? Come grab this other spinner. Okay. Get back to work. Jeez. <laughs> Slave driver over here. Making me fish. Come here, little guy. Wait. Aw. Uh, Be quiet. We've got another one. Ready? Lift, lift, lift. Wind down the lift so I can get a good stab on it. <laughs> Like scooping up babies. Scooping up I've never Kobe. scooped up a baby, but it's probably what it is. I think. Like. So I'm gonna. Do you want me to get the hook out? I'm out of breath. I know. Are you okay there, That's Pops? <laughs> you happy? I've never heard that laugh from you before. Uh, I like That's it. That's a happy laugh. That's a happy laugh. Daddy, happy. So happy. What do you think? Sushi tonight. Yeah, man. Sick. You know how we're gonna do this? Is we're gonna cut the fillet and we're gonna lay it out on a plate. And then we're gonna do olive oil over the top of them, black cracked pepper, and then about 20 minutes before we're ready to eat it, mm -hmm. we're gonna take and cut a, lot, a lemon in half. And we squeeze a lemon all over it, put it in the, in the refrigerator for about 20 minutes. And that, the chemical reaction with that lemon and that black pepper and olive oil changes everything about the taste of the fish. I think I'm gonna let him go here. There you go, Mr. Cobia. Bye, Cobes. What do you think about Rick Fisher? Let's go catch more stuff. You ready? Sportsman's Adventures is brought to you by Power Pole. Swift, silent, secure. Contender boats, always in the game. Casa Vieja Lodge, five star angling in beautiful Guatemala. FWC. The Florida Fish and Wildlife Conservation Commission and Suffix always use the best line. It's one of the most ancient forms of hide and seek known to man. And nobody knows how to play the fishing game better than the backcountry guides and offshore captains of the Florida Keys and Key West. Ready or not, here we come. Remember the glory days of gasoline? It's just not made the same anymore. Kick your gas into gear with StarTron. Pump up the performance in all of your engines. Cure the problems of ethanol with the power of enzymes. And maximize your mileage every time you drive. Kickstart your engines with StarTron. When you're paid to put fish in the boat, you don't mess around with the thing that puts fish in the boat. Always use the best line.
This week's Coast to Cool Place and Moment is the National Key Deer Refuge in Big Pine Key. The key deer is the smallest of 30 subspecies of whitetail and are found only in the lower Florida Keys. The smaller key deer thrived throughout the Florida Keys until the Indians and the hunters dwindled their numbers to less than 30. In 1957, the U.S. Fish and Wildlife established the refuge and since then, the endangered species has rebound to over 800 deer. The refuge has many places set aside to view the deer in their habitat, but the easiest way to spot them is to take a drive through the Big Pine Key area. They are easy to find wandering through the streets and grazing in the neighborhoods. So, the next time you're driving through Big Pine Key, come to the Visitor Center and check out the National Key Deer Refuge. All right, well, it looks like I need to put a big fish on the bottom. <coughs> Rick, go. Oh, the Goliath got me. I tried to stop him and the Goliath got me. Goliath ain't playing no more games. He's not giving us any more freebies. Oh, I just got eight. And... Yeah! <laughs> I'll be your sound check. I don't think this is a mangrove snapper. If it is, I don't want any part of it. Do you want to dance with me? Or... Oh, Bree, <laughs> why does this happen to me? All right, I'll tell him I said that. What do you think it is? I think it's somebody big. I stopped it. Gonna break? <laughs> oh, there it goes. I think I gotta put on a big rod and reel. Okay, you. It's you the signature. Me the off now. It's the signature. <laughs> that tasted like fish. I'm just gonna say it like it is. I'm tired of the BS, man. Every time I hook a fish. Snapper, cobia, something bigger eats it. So, what you do is now you go get a 50 caliber and then you go to the gunfight. So, we're gonna strap Bree into the Black Magic Equalizer belt and we're gonna put a big giant VMC circle hook on here and we're gonna see what keeps eating us and rip, swimming back up under the boat like it's a joke. It's not, I'm not joking anymore, it's pissing me off. Yep. Oh, I'd yeah. say you need to reel. Oh, Odie. Oh, oh, I can't wait. You're not letting me sit. <sighs> okay, just a second. Just a second. Ah, I reel. feel like I'm gonna go in the water. <laughs> no, you're not. Sit down. Just sit down and lean back. You're doing good. Keep your hand on that so if the line breaks, it don't hit you in the head. Okay, but don't let me fall. I won't. I got you. That's it. Reel. That's it, you're doing good. Sit down, and when you stand up, that's when it's gonna pump the line up. There you go, you're doing great. Okay. Doing good. That's it, get in the rhythm, that's it. Oh, wait. There you go. Sit down, there you go. 30 feet away. <clears throat> Come on, get him, put the heat on him. Put the heat on him. <laughs> I got you. Come on, put the heat on him. Come on, Bree. Wine. I'm trying. I saw him. Wine. Doing yeah. good. Get in the rhythm. That's perfect. Go pause yourself. What? Keep coming. Okay. Keep going. Let's see. Right Stop. Okay. okay. Back up. Wind, wind that to the tip so it doesn't hit me in the face. I'll hold him up here and you go catch your snapper. <laughs> You're going to hold him up here so we can catch the snapper? <laughs> That's how you put the meat on them, Bree. This is a be a perfect size to eat if we were eating. Yeah? The groupers, if they, if they weren't protected, boy, this would be the daddy to eat. No a nice daddy. little 40 pounder, maybe 50 pounds. I'm not quite sure. Now, Bree, a lot of guys 
they get crazy about the FWC rule. And I can tell you what the rule is if you're in state waters, the FWC, it's okay to pull him out of the water, get your hook out, and get him back in the water as quickly as possible. Okay. If you're in federal waters, which is where we are, we're in the Gulf of Mexico. Yes. So now we can't take him out of the water at all. Oh. So that's why I'm not pulling them up here. We're just gonna cut, I wanna see where the hook is. It's gonzo. So I'm just gonna cut it off. I do. Look at all, look. He up chucked something. What is that? A remora he kicked out of there? Yeah, but, a crazy too. <laughs> look at that mouth, Bree. Wow. So awesome. Look at this. Look at look at this. This is the only fish I know. High five you back. <laughs> High five, baby. High five. Look. 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 Cute. All right. We ready to let him go? I think so. All right. Good job. Hey now. I didn't ask for the bath. There we go. Going down. There you go, going Adios. down. Kick that tail. Ain't you got, a, he got some it. lyrics for that? Wiggle. You don't have no. Um, go and shake your tail feather. <laughs> go shake your tail feather. <laughs> Sportsman's Adventures is brought to you by Ameritrail. Load, launch, relax. Maverick Boat Group. Makers of premium boat brands Maverick, Hughes, and Pathfinder. Soft Science, Supreme Comfort Footwear, the American Fishing Tackle Company, any fish, any water, since 1958. And the Florida Keys and Key West, come as you are. A great boating experience has the Yamaha name on it. It's your key to legendary reliability. Right now, during the Yamaha Key to Reliability sales event, purchase any qualifying Yamaha outboard and exercise your power of choice between five years of Yamaha warranty protection or up to $1,500 in Yamaha dealer credit. The key to reliability is now your key to a great deal on a Yamaha outboard. Yamaha. Reliability starts here. Real. Real in. That? Yeah. Hurry, Bree. Hurry. Hurry. There you go. Good cat. Start reeling. Slowly. Easy, 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 easy. They eat you. Go. You got it? Stop, stop, stop. I'm gonna let my guy. You just got bit go. right there, I think. Yes, yeah. I did! There you go. Now we gotta figure out what's what. Woo! Okay. They're all coming towards us. Okay. Uh -oh. Uh, -oh. Uh, -oh. uh oh. Uh oh. Over. Are we dancing? Oh yeah. Wow, look how many permits Go. there are. Go. Look. Oh my gosh. Look at the permits going by, Bree. There's an I've acre of permits. So look many. at this. It's crazy. Isn't that cool? That is so cool. <clears throat> Friends. She's trying to go with Woo! his friends. Oh. Okay, I'm under. You're over. I love this two step we got going on, it's right? Just, the Kumas are doing good. Days over. Loaded up with 832 suffix. Ugh. They pull hard. There's no doubt. This is a cool version of a Jack Craval, Bree. How you doing up there, back there? Mine took kind of a dive. Yeah? So I'm just, yep. How you doing over there? Or up there? Yeah. Just surfaced? Well, my guy's finally Flushing getting him the close fist. here. Oh man, it's been a good day. All right, I can feel it, we're almost there. I'm right about here, I'm coming back. I'm gonna land this guy, get the hook out of him. So cool. Bree, how far away is your guy? 
<laughs> oh, he keeps diving. He's going down? Yeah, currently very, very fast. Okay. I'm gonna get the hook out of this one. We'll let him go. There we go. Ready? Ah. You ready for my help? How we doing there, Toots? I can't hear you. We're good, we're good, we're good. He's over there on the surface. He is? Yes. Whoa, wait till you see the size of this one, Miss Bree. <laughs> can't wait. Sitting here waiting. Oh man, this is a good day of fishing. Nice. Woo. Nice. <laughs> Look, Woo. Bob fills the net. Oh my god. Oh my goodness. Wow. Goodness, goodness, goodness. It's a monster. Dang. This is the showstopper. God. Wow. That's a nice fish there, Miss Bree. Whoa. Oh. Oh, I suppose I can pick him up after that. Good. Beautiful. Oh, you did so good. Wow. Great. Keep up with the latest Sportsman's Adventures news and events by logging into our website at sportsmansadventures.com and following us on Facebook, Twitter, and Instagram. Coming up next week on Sportsman's Adventures with Captain Rick Murphy. The real aim of this study is to find out if these maker sharks that really prowl the length and breadth of the Gulf of Mexico venture further afield. We find that they don't really, but that's what the science can help in terms of effecting management of fisheries anywhere. Anyway.